Hi, my name is Michael Olis. I'm a student in Physics 240 at the University of Michigan, and today I'm going to be explaining problem 7 on the Physics 240 second exam. As you can see right here, read it. Um, triangular solid in the shape of a 10 meter wide inclined plane has a height of 3 meters, length 4 meters, and a ramp length of 5 meters. A uniform horizontal magnetic field of B equals 1 Tesla is parallel to the 4 meter length. What is the magnetic flux through the ramp face stated in the figure? Use the standard convention for the normal vector direction of a closed surface. So first off, the step to setting up this problem is looking at the figure. So as you can see right here, you have a B is going through this surface right here, then coming out of this surface right here. And flux through a closed surface is always zero. So that means that the total flux going into the surface, the flat surface on the left, is the same as the surface coming out of the shaded area on the right. But they will have opposite signs because flux coming into a surface is positive and flux coming out is negative. So we have the equation here for magnetic flux equals BA times cosine of theta. And since we're solving for the first one, since it's equivalent to the second one, cosine of or theta is zero, so cosine of theta is one. So B is one Tesla and the area is 10 meters times three meters, which gives a flux into the surface of 30 tesla meter squared and since the surface the since the flux coming out of the surface is the negative of the flux coming into the surface the flux coming out of the surface is negative 30 tesla meter squared so that gives an answer of d